Welcome back, everyone. The risk of developing dementia in the United States, it is much higher than previously estimated. That's according to a new study just released today. Let's get more on the research with health reporter Stephanie Stahl. Yeah, this is a big study, you guys. You know, people in the United States are living longer, and with that comes increased rates of dementia. This new study says cognitive decline will double by 2060 and then impact about a million Americans a year. Karen and Anthony Sandone say they were living the good life until he was diagnosed with early onset Alzheimer's when he was 55. And I got lost in the car and I, I didn't know where I was. In addition to some memory loss, Anthony had trouble finding words. When you heard that diagnosis, what did it feel like? What was it like? Man, it, like, like a truck hit me. It was very devastating. Yeah, it really was. Now they're working with the Alzheimer's Association to raise awareness about the memory robbing type of dementia that's growing. New research says dementia numbers will double over the next 35 years. So the lifetime risk is very high. But study author Dr. Joseph Korish with NYU Langone says the study found the lifetime risk of developing dementia for people over the age of 55 is 42 percent. That's considerably higher than previous estimates based on newer information. This study looked at 15,000 people uh, followed since the late 1980s. Dr. Korsh says the risk goes up with age, especially after age 85. And he says the research highlights the need for more preventative measures. The things that prevent heart disease, like low blood pressure, no diabetes, no smoking, and then physical activity, sleep, then later there's a lot more hearing loss and I'd have people address hearing and vision loss and avoiding social isolation. The Sandones say it took two years to get the diagnosis. With early onset, there are medications that can slow progression, which Anthony is taking. So we do think that it's helping and we're certainly grateful that he was a candidate. Celebrating 15 years of marriage and hoping for many more. And the new research published in the journal Nature Medicine also finds dementia significantly higher among black American adults, and they also have an earlier onset. We have a lot more information on all of this dementia and Alzheimer's, cbsphiladelphia.com. I was going to see Karen thinks that it's helping, though. She hopes yeah. so, yeah. yes. Yeah. 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 All right. Stephanie, thank you. Mm -hmm.